Okay, so here we are going to uh, explain how to make a master mix for PCR reaction. So we have a, a stock solution, uh, which is 10 micromolar primer mix. Now this primer mix has forward uh, and backward. So, so this is a this mix has both, and then you have your diluted DNA template, which is five nanogram per microliter. That's your template. Uh, but oh, sorry. Uh, actually, this is not part of the mix. Uh, stuff. This has to be added separately. So for each reaction. For each reaction, we need a point A micromolar primer mix, and then a 10 nanogram template. And this means, in the volume, basically means two microliter primer mix of. 10 molar, and this is the 2 microliter, uh, 5 nanogram per microliter template. Okay, so this is actually one, and what means uh, there will be 21 microliter water as, as in the end. But to make a master mix, uh, let me change the color. The, the to make a master mix, the DNA has to be a uh, DNA is not in the max. A template is not in the master mix. Only the primer and the water will go to master mix. So for master mix, only this go to master mix. Right. So, so the master mix is going to have a two microliter primer. And 21 microliter water. We are going to make a master mix for three reactions, but we actually have to make it for four. If we make exactly three, we are going to short of some of our volume in the end. So we times four. That means eight and 84. We add them together, it should be 92. And that's the master mix. Let me change the color again. So, uh, what color? Let me change to yellow. Uh, but and but now you we we going to set up PCR reaction. So you are going to be given uh, uh, sorry, this is really bad drawing here. Uh, uh, okay, so you are. Going to give him point uh, two five uh, mil uh, PCR tubes, and each tube you're going to add uh, this volume, which is twenty three microliter to each tube here. That's from the master mix. You add twenty three. And then you ha make sure you label the tube. One of them should be a PMSH2. The other one should be a mutant you are study. And each group have their own mutant. You should label it a mutant something. And then you have the PRS413. That's your vector control. And you should also label your group number and section number. And it's probably good you also put your initial there just to uh, uh, in case. So then you also need to add uh, the template. Uh, there'll be five nanogram per microliter template for each one. Right. So you have a uh, you should have the uh, three diluted the three tube of the. You should have a fine nanogram the template of three tube, PMSH two, uh, mutant, 
and uh, PRS413. Uh, maybe I should change the color again. Uh, which one should I use? Blue. Okay. So, oh, blue on black is pretty bad. Sorry. Uh, I should remember this next time. So, but then you just take a. Let, let me change the different. Uh, that blue really doesn't show up. Sorry. Uh, magenta. Uh, okay, this is better. Oh, okay, okay, cool. Basically, I add two microliter of that. Uh, each one is two microliter. Two, two. Uh, so make sure they are they are matched. Uh, that's it. You, I think, is that. Well, that this will be done. Yeah. Yeah, they will, they will, 